Hey guys, it's Sean from the Orbs team. Uh, I'm the community lead over at Orbs, and I'm going to be walking you through everything that's new between Orbs and QuickSwap with our DTWAP integration. Uh, this is our first one ever on Polygon, and it's super exciting for us as we expand not only into a very large DEX, a well-known DEX. I mean, it's also large, but they're also they're also well-known. Uh, but also a new a new ecosystem that you know is is obviously very big and and has a lot of um, integrations in their in their own right. Um, so before we jump in here, I just want to say how excited we are here at Orbs. Um, this is a super like super big integration for us. QuickSwap is one of the big, biggest DEXs in the entire crypto space. Um, they facilitate, I think in the last seven days, I just checked it on DeFi Llama. Um, they're facilitating over $100 million in weekly transaction volume. And, you know, in the bull market, that can be as big as 10, 20, even, you know, even further, more than that, um, times larger uh, volumes. And so they can see larger volumes in the bull market. Um, so I think, I think this integration, and, and I think the whole team is, is with me on this, it, it really establishes Orbs as a leading innovator in the DeFi space. It shows the community that Orbs is really starting to elevate our brand and in, in, in the DeFi arena as more and larger DEXs become familiar with, with our project. So before I ramble all day here, um, let's, let's jump in here. Um, and some of you might have already noticed that yes, we are on the testing website. So it's just something to be aware of if something changes between now and when we're live. Uh, but it is really unlikely as, as the UI is, is finished. So again, I'm just on the, uh, the, the, the traditional home screen here of, of QuickSwap on the best trade. Um, and before we jump in, I wanted to go over and highlight or explain rather for people that don't know what DT DTWAP is. So DTWAP aims to reduce price impact by executing a large transaction, or really it, it doesn't necessarily have to be large, it just depends on how much liquidity is, is there, into smaller chunks. Um, so for example, if you have a uh, million dollars and you wanted to you know, execute that over, um, you know, a period of time, you know, if you want to execute that with the best possible market price, you could do that with, with DTWAP by setting it up to execute over, say, the entire day instead of instantly swapping it as, you know, we're so used to here uh, in DeFi or, you know, when using a DEX rather. So we are on here, uh, again, we're on, the, we're on the best trade. And I just want to show you guys, so we're going to be, so for this video, we're going from Rat uh, Medic to Quick New. That's what we're going to be doing with um, in, in, the, in our DTWAP transaction. And we'll go ahead and click max here. And we'll wait for it to fill up. There we go. And so even, even a transaction of this, and it was more yesterday, it was around 5%. But even like a smaller transaction of, of you know, 2.3K, it, it, we're still having a price impact, like it, it's jumping around as I talk here, of over 2%. Um, yeah, it jumps down, it jumps, it jumps around. But, um, you know, you can see this even grows. Well, let's say like AVAX, um, which is a token with, with much more liquidity, uh, or much less, excuse me, on, on, on QuickSwap. Excuse me, you can see we have a price impact of 6%. And that's only on two, 2,000. You can imagine what this will be. Like here, we, we, I think it'll show me if I do a bigger number here. Um, yeah, that shows me price impact is more than 15%. So we can't even, we can't even use it here. Um, so it's something that, you know, you gotta be, you gotta be conscious of when you're, when you're trading. Um, and, and, it's, and it's what we're going to uh, help eliminate here with, with DTWAP. Um, before we jump in here, um, I also wanted to make a note that we at Orbs uh, have, uh, are going to now be the new limit order solution on QuickSwap. Um, previously, they were doing uh, QuickSwap was using Gelato. Um, they're switching over to us after some due diligence. Um, we are not, uh, you know, as an end user on QuickSwap, nothing is going to change. It's you know, it's it's going to be the same process as it was with Gelato. Um, it's just now powered by the Orbs router, or not router, rather the Orbs network uh, protocol, whatever you want to say, um, rather than than Gelato. Um, so yeah, just want to make note of that, and it's something. You know, it's something that, that's really cool because 
we're already, you know, we're adding a new order type and we're also supporting a functional, an already functional order type that the community is used, used to. Um, so, and again, you know, QuickSwap does over 100 million, so <laughs> Orbs community, pay, pay attention here. Um, but yeah, so we'll, we'll jump into the TWAP. Um, and again, we're going from Rapmatic, Matic, excuse me, to Quick. And we'll click Max. Okay, cool. Um, so as you see, as I, as I clicked Max there, we kind of got all these um, uh, parameters, configuration settings um, that I'm going to walk you through pop up. Um, all right, so we'll start at uh, limit price. So as limit price is, um, you actually don't need to enable it. Um, if you don't want to, you know, if you don't, your, your transaction, your DTWAP trend trades, they're going to execute at whatever the market price is. So if we get a bar, if it crabs, if it goes up, if it goes down, it goes sideways, doesn't matter, um, it's going to be executed. If you don't want that to happen, we can go ahead and click, we can enable it with this little side button um, and we can change this to say, let's say 20. So um, this will only execute if one Rapmatic is equal to 20 quick new. Um, we do 30, we do 40, we do 50. Because apparently I can't type 40, there we go. <laughs> um, whatever you want this to be. And if you want to set up the inverse of this, um, you can just click that right here. Um, for the purposes of this video, um, we're going to leave it off since, you know, we might be here for a while. Um, but something to be aware of, if we go back here, um, if you set this below, so again, if you guys remember, we were at 15, so below that's 10. Um, this is just going to execute as like a traditional um, market order since it's already, um, you know, equal to that. It's already greater than or equal to that. So that'll just execute instantly. So be careful if you're setting this up. Um, you know, uh, if you're setting a limit order up, make sure that you're configuring it correctly. Okay, cool. Jumping down here to the next one. So total trades. This is actually going to be the total amount of trades that your DTWAP uh, or yeah, your DTWAP order will, will actually tr break your order up into. Um, and that's reflected as I kind of move this down here. So 50 trades, we're breaking it up into $45 each. Uh, we can bring it back, you know, $75 a trade, or we can keep going all the way to 10.01 uh, one cent. Um, and the reason why you can't get, oh, and it just blacked out and it tells you right here. Uh, but the reason we can't go lower than this is because the total trade side size must be equal uh, to at least 10 USD. Um, so just be, you know, be aware of that. Um, but for something, but for our video, um, we'll go ahead and just do, let's say 10 transactions. That's pretty good. Um, okay, cool. So trade interval. So each of these, so the total amount of trades that we just um, established up here, um, this is going to be the interval that they trade at. So every two minutes, one of these 10 are going to uh, execute and actually swap the Rapmatic for the quick. Um, and this is where it kind of gets cool because you can set up different if, if you want, anyways, you can set up different um, dollar cost averaging strategies. So you could put it day, you could do hours here. You know, every hour I want to buy into to quick or every day I want to buy into quick. Um, and so you can kind of set that up here. Um, again, though, for our video, you know, I'm not going to, I'm not going to make us sit here for uh, uh, <laughs> two days. That might be, that might be a little excessive, um, but we'll go ahead down here to the, the next one. So max duration is just how long this transaction is going, this DTWAP transaction is going to stay open for. Um, make sure here that you are always double checking this setting as you don't want to um, run out of time and have your trade ellipse without it being completely filled. Um, you know, like, and that's, you know, definitely gets more important when we are uh, trying to set up a dollar cost averaging strategy. Um, but for here, it doesn't really matter. Um, so, well, you know, just like trade interval, you have minutes, hours, and days. I mean, 40 minutes is good. That I mean, that was the default recommended. Um, so we will go ahead and click place order. Um, so if it's your first time doing this, you'll probably have to go through a couple of prompts. Um, you'll have to prove the, that the token can be sent, spent. You might have to wrap your Matic. Um, and you also have to approve the limit. Um, 
I've already done that here in advance, uh, but you know, that's just your usual uh, MetaMask prompts that you'll go ahead and confirm. Um, so what we have here is a uh, review of the order. So we can ensure that the settings that we just configured are correct. We have expiration, order type, trade size, total trades, trade interval, minimum received per trade. Um, and these settings all look correct. This is of course what we just set up. Here's our 10, here's our two minutes. Here's the trade size that we saw and we, we didn't establish uh, a limit order. So it is going to execute at whatever the market is. We'll get a disclaimer here. Um, we'll go ahead and scroll through and we'll accept and then click confirm order. We'll then follow the prompts in MetaMask. I will give it a little bit more of gas to make it quicker for our for the video here. So we're not here all day. I don't know what the, it's a busy day in the market. So, or um, not the market, rather the, the network. So. We'll go ahead and wait for it to confirm. And there we go. And cool, it, uh, it shows up right down here. So here is our order history. Uh, we can see open. I have one canceled because uh, you know I've been testing, like I said. Um, and we can go ahead and expand the details here. And we can see the current uh, status of the order, how much percentage has been filled. And we can see, again, you can triple, quadruple check at this point the, the configuration. Um, and assuming everything is correct, which it is for us, um, you know, we don't have to do anything, but if you wanted to, you could go ahead for whatever reason and cancel this order. Um, or, you know, if you're dollar cost average, you know, you set up a dollar cost average up here with interval and duration, um, you could cancel that if you no longer wanted to buy into a specified asset. So yeah, guys, in, in conclusion, that's, that's pretty much it. That, that's DTWAP. Um, I just want to reiterate how, how excited we are here at Orbs, um, about this, this, this integration. It's super exciting for us and we hope to continue, um, you know, being a partner for, for QuickSwap and expanding our, our offerings, our, our layer three offerings. Um, so stay tuned guys. And thank you for spending the past 10, 15 minutes with me and good luck uh, with your trades. See you next time.